Hi, second semester student of Diploma in Architecture. Civil Engineering Department. This notes is made for Building Services 1 course. Which course code is DCA 20092? Today, we will learn about Topic 1, Bathroom and Restroom Design. What is a bathroom? A bathroom is a room containing a bathtub or shower and usually a sink and toilet. There are several types of bathroom. Master bathroom containing four plumbing fixtures, a toilet and sink, and either a bathtub with a shower, or a bathtub and a separate shower stall. Jacuzzi bathroom is a large bath with a system of underwater jets of water to massage the body. A shower is a place in which a person bathes under a spray of typically warm or hot water. A shower can be installed in a small shower stall or bathtub with a plastic shower curtain or door. A three-piece bathroom is a restroom three plumbing fixtures, a sink and a toilet plus one other fixture. How about powder room? Powder room have all the basic restroom necessities such as a toilet, sink, and toiletries, primarily made for and used by guests. Okay you or disabled bathroom is designed to accommodate people with physical disabilities. This animation explains requirements for accessible toilet rooms in the ADA and ABA standards. Accessible toilet rooms must be on an accessible route and have compliant doors so that people with disabilities, including those who use wheelchairs, can enter the space. Required clearances provide sufficient room to enter, clear the door, turn around, and close and lock the door. The clear floor space required at water closets accommodates a variety of transfers, including side transfers. Transfer techniques vary among users based on personal preferences and abilities, room layout, and other factors. Grab bars on the side and rear walls are critical for transfer. Flush controls must be located on the open side of the water closet. Clearances are also required at laboratories and other elements, including soap dispensers, towel dispensers, and hand dryers. The standards include criteria for the usability of faucet controls and other operable parts. Door maneuvering clearances provide room to approach and open doors, and to exit the space. The size of single-user toilet rooms is determined by room layout, configuration of fixtures, the The minimum width of residential bathroom according to uniform building by law is not less than 1.5 square meter width of not less of 0.75 meters in the case of bathroom with close fittings not less than 2 square meters width of not less than 0.75 meters while the minimum height of residential bathroom not less than 2 meters 
the minimum openings for natural lighting and natural ventilation of residential bathroom according to uniform building by law is the area of the openings must not less than 0.2 square meter however the natural ventilation and natural lighting shall not apply if there is a permanent mechanical ventilation installed in the bathroom the next session is about the types of sanitary fitting and materials wash basin is a bowl for washing typically attached to a wall and having taps connected to a water supply There are several types of bathroom basins such as a wall-mounted basin, a pedestal basin, a corner basin, an undermount basin and a tabletop basin. A sink in a kitchen is a basically a hardware bowl used for washing dishes, vegetables, etc. The types of sinks are undermount sinks, double basin or bowl sink and single sink. Bathtub is a container for holding water in which a person or animal may bathe. Freestanding tubs are unconnected to walls or any other surface except for the floor. Freestanding bathtubs require a large bathroom to accommodate the tub. Alcove bathtub fits precisely within a three-sided enclosure built just for the tub. A drop-in. Bathtub is a shell that fits into a prepared deck. Corner tubs are large, triangular bathtubs that, as the name says, fit into a corner of the bathroom. Water closet or flush toilet is a toilet that disposes of human waste, urine and feces, by using water to flush it. Types of water closet or sitting toilets are one-piece toilet, two-piece toilet and upflush toilet. All sanitary appliances are made of non-absorbent, non-corroding, smooth and easily cleaned material. <laughs> 